So welcome back to Statistics 101. Today we're going to learn something insanely cool. You might remember from the very beginning of this class that we had data sets that involve more than one dimension. For example, the size of a house relative to its price. And initially we talked about scatter plots, we talked about bar charts, but we didn't talk about what's the holy grail of statistics. And that is fitting a line to the data points. After this unit, you'll be able to fit a line to data points like those, and you'll even be able to tell me what the residual error is in that fit. And that allows us not just to understand the data, but also to make predictions about points we've never seen before. So let's dive straight in. So let's talk about lines. And let's talk about the technology to fit lines to data called linear regression. If I have two-dimensional data, such as the age of a person and the person's income, and this is obviously made up data, then linear regression tries to fit a line that best describes the data. So how do we specify a line? Suppose we call the horizontal axis x, x, and suppose we call the vertical axis y. Then a line is commonly described by a functional relationship between x and y of the following form, y equals b times x plus a. So let's look at lines. Let's take a simple example, y equals 2x. Let's add units to the axis of the coordinate system. And let me draw three different examples of lines, a blue line, a green line, and a red line. And for this example, y equals 2x, can you imagine which of the three lines would be described by this equation? Please check one of these three boxes. 